Fight but I don't know what my accent is really, so... Oh, there we go. Oh god, is this screen? Yes, it is this screen. Ah. Uh, the so... loading screen. <laughs> it's still spinning! <laughs> Uh, so, tell me, now that you are rested and have leveled up, what would you like to do? There is a path, conveniently, that goes both into the forest and out into the plains. Well, Which direction? I think, I think that like we should take? find the closest, uh, the closest patch of civilization and spread the good word of the queen. I don't know about spreading the good word of the queen, but uh, fine, we should at least, word, at least, well, I do like the idea of going to find some kind of civilization. Uh, it seems like a good idea. Yeah. Uh, is there... Uh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, does anyone, I guess, see a good place we can go to, I guess, get a, 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 a lay of the land around here? Some, some tall place around here? Well, there's lots of trees. You could climb up one of them and try and get a view on what's going around here. Uh... Wiki got a bad feeling about that. Yeah, it seems like it'd be really, really dangerous, especially in all that armor you're wearing. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm not inclined to, to do that. I mean, I wouldn't mind if someone... Falling over. Why don't we <sighs> set the ranger up? Yeah, would, would, would you be, um, you know, okay with, uh... You know, checking up there, Mr. Uh, Rysis? Sure. Seems how your armor is gonna lay you down anyways <laughs> even though it's missing a big section out of the middle now I, just, I we'll, we'll, I'll figure that I'll fix this later <laughs> uh, does he have to All do right. like, some kind of a survival roll or whatever so yeah I guess we're trying to find out where the uh, the closest yeah. uh, patch of civilization is right so rogue is going to climb the tree correct yep all right uh give me an Choose between athletics and acrobatics, whichever you would rather roll. Hmm. Let's do acrobatics. <laughs> okay. Why? So, should have done. Uh, should have done you attempt, athletics. You attempt to climb the tree, and you get a little ways up, but. One of the branches under your feet snaps, and you're left hanging onto uh, a branch in the tree. But you're high <laughs> enough up. For, you're not so high up that if you let go, you would take damage. Uh, Mr. Rises, maybe you should have done some stretches before climbing. Ah, Are you it must okay? Be one of those it must be one of those legendary oil just, trees. I just <laughs> woke up. All right, give me a minute. <laughs> That's the only explanation for how such a for how such a proficient man of the forest like you could have slipped and fell, fallen. Yeah, oh, he didn't else. slip and fell. The branch broke. Right, it's, slipped it's and fell. It's the tree's fault. <laughs> <laughs> you need to eat some salads. <laughs> well, I'm gonna is let there go and we could possibly try again. Again? Yeah, why not? Uh, oh, wait, can I can I climb up? I mean, Nova, uh, you may attempt. Choose acrobatics or athletics. There you go. Yeah. I think the, the success shuffle is going to be a little weird here. Mm hmm. How about we limit it to, like, maybe three people trying in action? Okay. I Unless will decide what that means. Like oh, okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, Twinkie attempts to climb the tree, but he can't quite reach enough branches to be able to climb up it properly. Uh, <laughs> These trees are just too damn tall, I tell you. Can I give him a boost? <laughs> um, sure, the two of you may work together. Uh, each of you can roll Twinkie. acrobatics or athletics, <laughs> and uh, one of you will... Okay, Rogue will roll acrobatics, and then Nova will roll acrobatics, and he'll have advantage. As long as Rogue gets a decent roll. Okay, so with the help of um, Illithan, Twinkie the Unbreakable manages to climb up and reach the top of the tree and is able to look out over the plains and the forest. 
You see anything up there, Twinkie? Oh, I see something. Uh, you see a whole lot of forest. Mm. And you see a whole lot of plains. Mm. You do not see any signs of civilization. Well, besides can, the road. I, I can say one thing. There's a lot of grass out there and there's a lot of trees, but I don't know where we need to go. <sighs> Perhaps following the path through the forest will, will take us to whatever civilization lays within, if you can't see anything over that clear area over there. Do you, do you at least see anything so. that looks like like people have been walking through it? Yeah, smoke or something like that, it's, maybe from some fires. I see a bunch of trees being ripped up and toppled over. Uh, what? You repeat well, that, please? <laughs> I think maybe he's talking about, like, a, a path or something. Are they currently being ripped up? No, it looks like they've already fell over. It's only like a straight line. I think someone was chopping down a lot of trees recently. <laughs> uh, okay. okay. Well, I mean, like, that sounds like uh, some potential there, I guess. What do you guys think? Uh, I'm We're supposed still to be down. the best option right now. I'm still okay with following the path. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go with following the path. Alright. Alright. And as you're Sorry, walking anything through... that can chop trees down that quickly and that violently is not some <laughs> is not a, a group that I wanna encounter. Uh, no thank you. <laughs> so you'll be taking the road through the uh through the forest. Mm. Yes. Yes. Indeed. Alright, and give me a general idea of the order and formation you're going to be walking through here, and any oh, anything specific you're doing as you're walking. God, I am probably real gosh darn interested in uh, in Ilfen and his vodka. <laughs> We're in the back. Uh, I guess I'm... I'm hmm? Probably Wait. somewhere in the middle of the group, just like looking at all the trees and the wildlife. Maybe taking occasional here. notes in my diary. You know, just, just all right. Salem things. Uh, rookie? Or do you think you'd be? Oh man, we're getting typing. Oh snap. <laughs> <laughs> so, Rookie's in the back. Uh, no, okay, back. Charlie in the back. Okay. Uh, I guess I'm... Jennifero, hmm? Twinkie's legs are tired. Can you carry me on your shoulder? Uh, sure, but didn't you just wake up? Um, obviously, his legs haven't just, woken up yet. Just My legs are still, you know, that's, that's asleep. Fine. I, I guess right. it's fine. Like, uh, as, you know, I'll be up in the front. And you, I guess you can keep an extra pair of eyes for me. Athletics. Oh God. God He's no not going around. to stop. It's just gonna. It's always going to be uh, Twinkie <laughs> attempting to ride on Kirby's shoulders. <laughs> that's right, an eighteen. Athletics. Oh. <laughs> uh... <laughs> so. Twinkie, you actually managed uh, to get up onto his shoulders, Twinkie, but Jinnipro quickly finds that it is tiring carrying a tired Twinkie. You know, on top of all the gear he's probably got on him. Yes. I mean, those muscles are heavy, man. <laughs> uh, Twinkie, can you, I don't know, can, uh, can you get off now? Like, this is, this is carrying way too much for me right now. I mean, Stop. It, Stop being a milk drinker. You can carry me. Listen, if we if we still had that that horse that was like invisible, maybe we could have offloaded some of this weight that you've got on you. But this is this is this is a bit too much to me right now. Twinkie well, wants more cookies. He oh. tried to eat my horse and it disappeared. <laughs> I'm sure we'll find more cookies whenever we get someplace with a bar. Be fair, Twinkie was hungry. The bar cookies are the best cookies. Uh, sure. Uh, As well, you're can walking. I as no. you're walking through here, I would like uh, Jinnipro and Salem to give me perception checks. Oh dear. Alright, let's see. Oh god! <laughs> Why? You're you distracting right? me. Rip. Oh, oh what god. is this? <laughs> what is this? Oh my god! Oh, I guess this is the part where we all get fucked by the long dick of the law. Salem is, is just like, uh, you know, read, writing too many notes. Yeah. Oh no. You guys you think the least perceptive people to make these checks. Because everybody else was distracted. You were yeah. the two paying attention. 
I it was all just makes walking sense. along. <laughs> Kirby was in the lead. Salem was looking out at the wildlife, so she had the potential <laughs> to notice this. Oh boy. Uh oh. Lay it on us. Oh boy, what's happening? Alright, what visual novel have we entered now? <laughs> As you are walking, a man walks out from the woods about 20-30 uh, feet in front of you. Oh no, I didn't upload the image. Give me a moment. <laughs> <laughs> Rip. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't be a stream with Kirby without technical difficulties. <sighs> Re. <laughs> yes, chat, we did in fact leave the horse behind and Rookie's retainer. It's some random guy in the woods. <sighs> I didn't it forget my really I didn't pretty. Get my horse, okay? <laughs> yeah, no. Oh, boy. You know, you know what? You don't even have to pass a wisdom check for Salem. She's already smitten. <laughs> <laughs> You and me both, sister. <laughs> oh, oh, boy. He says, Well, hello there, travelers. Where'd what you come brings from? You to the... um, <clears throat> sorry, uh, sorry, excuse me. That bush over there. The, the, the woods? Uh, I live here? Uh, yes, yeah, sorry. Uh, I, I was just a little kind of distracted with dealing with this. Um, hey, um sir, uh, hi. Uh, how, how are you doing today? Oh, I'm doing quite wonderful. That's 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 good to hear. Um, I'm sorry for you know intruding in your woods here. Uh, we oh. we oh it's fine. It's just um, if you would like to continue, I'm a. Uh... You see, we don't get a lot of travelers here, and uh, sometimes we can be a little light on resources, if you understand what I am saying. Yeah, bro. Like he has a bad feeling about this. For context, Salem is just stock still right now, just stuck staring at this guy. And her he... face is getting more and more progressively red by the minute. He looks towards Salem and gives a single wink. Oh. She, oh. she like, her, fla sparkles. her face flashes red. And she hides behind Kirby. <laughs> so, Hell yeah. Oh, some more Reese. context. We have three people in the back. Uh, Tim, Lothran, and Ricky. Yeah. Do not trust this guy. Yeah. About how fa far back from uh, the front three are you? We're looking at, I don't know, I'd say we're probably a good... I imagine here, how this rolled was uh, Jennifer like walked forward and started conversing with the student. We're like maybe about ten or fifteen feet backward, just being yeah. like, "I'm pretty sure this guy's going to try to stab us, guys." <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's about what I'd see. Uh, well, oh, um, sir, you say hold on. I'm drinking bros mm -hmm. with Illithin over here. Uh, I, I was going to say something <laughs> in response to the guy. Uh, uh, go ahead, Kirby. Uh, s uh, s you said something about uh, needing help with resources. Uh, well, yes. we're 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 new to this neck of the woods, um, and we oh, yes, are. Yes, I can see that. Yeah, yeah. Um, After and all, we... you don't know my name. Yeah, yeah. Oh, forgive me. I should have introduced myself sooner. My name's Antonio Salvaggio. Uh, uh, hello there, Mister. Uh... From, from behind Kirby, Salem squeaks. Salem. <laughs> <laughs> it's a pleasure to meet you, Salem. Uh, she is like her face. You know those anime like shots where like the people like the girls' faces go like really bright red. Yep. And they like get like that. She yep. that's her right now. <laughs> uh, uh, hi there. Uh, uh, my name is uh, Dina Pro Wingar. Uh, I actually I, I was I was wondering um, w since we're like new to this place, uh, we kind of would like if it's if it's at all possible for us to assist you in. I guess, like, gathering any kind of resources around here, you know, that can also possibly give us a lay of the land here? Well, uh, yes, you can assist us by handing over all of your valuables. <sighs> Except for, uh, the lovely lady over there. She can now, keep hers. Twinkie respectfully disagrees with what you just said. Uh, I'm sorry? Uh, yeah, uh, if... If you don't, if you don't, if you don't step away, 
from our entire group right now, Twinkie will rip your head off and shove it up your ass. You know, I'm, in intimidate check. I'm inclined to agree with, with uh, Mr. Twinkie here, because I would really like for him to get off my shoulders. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh... Are we really going to do this? Like, every oh, time? Oh dear. Oh, you have successfully intimidated him. He takes a few <laughs> steps back. <laughs> but then he raises his hand and snaps a finger. Beside him, two more people walk out. And behind the group, on the other side, another two people walk out. I count five. Well, boys, it looks like they aren't uh, willing to go quietly. They all, all of the men draw their weapons. You see short swords and you see daggers. You don't see any ranged weaponry on any of them, but uh, Antonio himself uh, draws a rapier. Oh, boy. Can I make the first move? Ooh. Um, you would all have to roll initiative first. Uh, oh. oh, shit. Uh, oh. I oh, what? <laughs> there you go. Oh man, a fellow duelist, eh? Oh god, I, I was just about to, to try to try to smooth talk out of this, but nope, can't do anything about that Well, now. you can still attempt that. Okay. Would you like to? Well, where is the uh, initiative thing again? Um, where is it? it? Right the right next right to your armor class, I think? Okay. Yeah. Uh, do I need to roll initiative regardless, or what? Uh, yeah, just roll initiative regardless, but I'll still give you an opportunity to talk them down. Okay. Wait, can I use one of my skills? Uh, who, who said that? Twinkie. Um, Twinkie. can you use one of your what? My skills. What? What? Oh wait, what happened to it? Hmm? Oh wait. Oh, what happened to it? Rip. Ah, uh, never mind. I was gonna okay. use muscle. Oh wait, language. Oh, that's a language. <laughs> <laughs> Um, sadly, Antonio does not speak the language of muscles. Oh, I wasn't trying to communicate with him. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, did, did, did my initiative thing, uh, show up on your side? Yes. Cause, okay, it just says about you wanted to send the result of this troll, but to the troll turn uh, tracker. Uh, yeah, don't worry about that. Okay, okay. Jeez. Those are some amazing initiative rolls, guys. <laughs> I mean... You've got like three really good ones, and then three kind of mad ones, and then just Twinkie over there. Not to worry, Jennifer. Uh, not to worry, Jennifer. I have. I was about to say a plan, but really, this is just a shot in the dark. <laughs> okay, so how would you like to uh, talk all of these men down? Oof. Uh. Well, I already said the initial thing. Um. Okay, okay, so, uh, so I look, I take a look around, and I look back at the, uh, the initial, uh, uh the initial guy, and then, uh, I say, like, when I mean that we're kind of new to this place, I mean, we were just kind of just Gosh. thrown here, like, the only thing you'd be getting is just simply just some worn out equipment that probably wouldn't give you much gold. Really? Because I, I see those gold pouches. On your belts. They look um, quite full to me. These gold pouches are actually chocolates. <laughs> Roll me deception. <laughs> yeah, before before God uh, No, I'm gonna let him roll the goddamn right. die. It's it's just him that's that's rolling deception, right? Thank thank you. Oh, thank you, Twinkie the Unbreakable. Thank you. Natural one yes. Another natural one in a row. Yes, oh, those are definite. I'm sure those are some delicious chocolates in there. Yeah, I believe you. Totally. He uh, points his rapier up. I think I'm going to take you down first, short stuff. Well, oh, there we go. Did you well... just sir? <laughs> oh, no. Wait, wait, no. wait, no. wait. Short oh, stuff. Ah! 
<laughs> oh. Oh. Okay, combat oh, time. Oh, bit of the deer. Uh, All right. Uh, I'm not. I'm. I'm not interested in fighting. <laughs> oh God. Well, uh, you see, uh, one of the two bandits that's uh, behind you, Gray, says, "Well, we are." Uh, uh, I'm just filling out my uh, initiative uh, order. Um, <laughs> sorry that this is going to take a bit. <laughs> Uh, should we be saying what uh, we're, I guess, we're equipping or something? Uh, or I... No, you will do that on your turn. Oh, okay. Yeah, sorry. I wasn't sure when that would be done. <clears throat> uh, okay. Uh, Rookie and Salem, I need both of you to give me flat D20s. Because you're uh, tied for initiative. Respectable. Respectable. Okay. Uh, all right. So Salem will be going before Rookie. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, jeez. And, and he's also very angry now. Oh, no. Well, I mean, at least oh, he could try no. to catapult off of me or Just something. Throw him at him. Just throw Is him this when we die? The first fight? <laughs> <sighs> Just throw a. Uh, just throw Twinkie at him. <laughs> like a cannonball. Um, uh... Is that a skill that I'd need? No, I think that would have to be like I would be. Have to I go think that's almost like an improvised weapon or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Swinging him around by the feet, just All gonna right. hit a motherfucker so, with another motherfucker. <laughs> initiative begins, and with a baffling amount of speed, Antonio moves forward and strikes up with his rapier, aiming straight at Twinkie. Ooh. Oh, oh my! Oh, we've got a real edge lord here. He's flash stepping now. Oh, shit. Uh, what is your armor class, Twinkie? Uh, armor class is 13. All right. Is that including your armor? Because your armor class, you might not he have doesn't actually wear any put armor, your... Oh, okay, I he doesn't wear any armor, never mind. He's a barbarian. But, uh, well, but he yeah, he goes armor. up, he, barbarian. Shouldn't he, have both he stabs things? you, but in your, your rage and adrenaline... <laughs> Even though it ha you haven't used this, the ability yet, just def causes the blade to just sort of bounce off of your muscles. <laughs> <laughs> now that's a message sent by the language of muscle for sure. I don't want to mess with Illithin, me. it is your turn. There are two bandits behind you. All right, I'm gonna. And there are three in front of you. Oh, are do, are we gonna switch over to squares? Because like that's gonna make spellcasting a little easier. Uh, there will not be, uh, squares, no, I do not have a grid set up. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and put Hunter's Mark on the... All right. ...suave guy that just stabbed Twinkie. Okay. And then, uh, go for a headshot. All right. Uh, give me an attack roll. Oops, lost my character sheet. One second. Uh, oh. you fire, but you, uh, with Twinkie and Jinnipro in the way, your arrow goes wide, going over all of their heads and landing in the dirt a ways, a ways ahead. Okay. Um, it is now one of the bandits next to Antonio's turn. Uh, he moves up and he takes out his dagger and he attempts to stab at Jinnipro. Okay. Um, uh, does that does a fifteen hit you, Curb? My armor class is sixteen plus two because of shield. So no, it does not hit. Uh, he goes up and he slashes at you, but your armor just easily keeps the attack off of you. Better remember to manage your stamina. Uh, Salem, it is your turn. Alrighty, so I'm gonna actually uh. I want to I see something real quick. So, you're saying it's like they're like kind of like this, right? 
Oh. And then there's two more here, and we're in the middle? Yeah, that's what's going on right now. Okay, so, question. Mm-hmm. If I did Magic Missile right now, would people in front of me have to dodge? No. Uh, uh, magic get... Missile is an auto-hit. It doesn't, uh... It'll just magically go around your allies. Okay, so... How about... I'm gonna use Magic Missile. Uh -huh. On the two people behind us, and the guy who just attacked Kidapro. Alright. So, it would be the uh, attack roar, right? Yeah. Holy oh, shit! Whoa! whoa. Nice. Magic Missile does not have an attack roll, so I'm afraid oh. this... You have wasted a natural work. 20. That's unfortunate. No! That's... So how do I roll for it, though? <laughs> uh, it's probably because you put it in your attacks and spellcasting list, which is why uh, that happened. I will just... There. So 1d4 plus... 4 charisma... Okay, so wait, hang on. I uh, I'm going to double check something with um, magic missile. Uh, what do you need to know? Magic missile. Uh, you do not add your charisma modifier to magic missile's damage. So okay. I it's will nine, uh, six, calculate seven. each of these damages myself. I uh, got a. So that's a 5, that's a 2, and that is also a 2. So uh, the one next to Jinnipro takes, of... uh, takes, the, takes the brunt, the biggest impact. Uh, and the other two are just kind of knocked off balance. They're hurt, but not severely so. So Salem, uh, the context of what happened there is like Salem like, sees all the fighting ground. She goes, eep, and just kind of casts a spell. <laughs> you know, just out of reflex. And it, it, yeah. hit peep, it hit peep through people. All right. Uh, next is Rookie. Rookie? Rookie. Uh, who are you attacking? Uh, which of the... Uh, I guess it doesn't matter. He's, he's oh. back here with us, so I assume the two people who are behind us. Yeah. Okay, so uh, that hits. Uh, roll damage. I'll do uh, roll click, damage. Click the name of the attack. Oh, that's it. Uh, yeah, in the chat. Click it in the chat. Not in, not in your sheet. Okay. Um. Let me just <laughs> double check this as well. Uh, attributes and ability. Whoops. Spells. Workers. Oh, no. That's all for gear. Oh, they have to make a dexterity saving throw. Okay, it's not an attack roll. It's a. These guys are new to spell casting. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, 20, 20 plus 2. <laughs> Uh, he manages to succeed on his saving throw, uh, so you do no damage. Blah. The shame, it was cool looking. Blah. I'd imagine, like, just, he, like, uh, just, like, he just, like, just, Now it, it, that's it's, it. uh, the turns of those two bandits that took the magic missiles. Uh, one of them has a short sword, and, uh, seeing that Rookie just tried to stab him with some kind of magical sword swirly thing... Uh, he's going for Rookie. Uh, does a 14 hit you, Rookie? Uh, yes it does. Oof. Oof. Oh. oh dear. What are you doing, Roll20? Okay. Uh, you take 3 damage, Rookie. Oof. Oh. Oof. And, uh, the one next to him, also wielding a short sword, is gonna take a swing at Timothy, because Timothy said he didn't want to fight. 
Well, then if I said I didn't want to fight, then it would seem as though I should be the one who doesn't have to worry about fighting. <laughs> You'd think that, but... Uh, <laughs> fighting is a free action. They're, they're Why bad. can't we be friends? I just kind of nimbly like dodge out of the way, and I'm just like, hey, hold on a second, I said I'm not interested in fighting. I said you're gonna have to. I Obviously I don't have to, as you can um... see. And now uh, it's the other bandit next to uh, Antonio's turn, and uh, seeing that his friend just got blasted by a spellcaster, uh, he's he moves up to like take a swing at Salem, but then Antonio just kind of gives him a shove, and uh, his attack. Oh, wins. oh I see him. He's a gentleman. At least. Uh, Timothy, it is your turn. Uh, I think I'm probably so, Jennifer. Uh, what's your plan on this one? Uh, remember, I'm still on your shoulder. So yeah, I so like I wanted to. Uh, I guess I initially wanted to attack uh, the guy that you know, the initial dude, Antonio. But mm -hmm. like, I figured that um, um, Twinkie's like you know, in, in the enraged mode, he's gonna be going after after that dude. So I don't have to, I guess, do anything with him. Can just mm -hmm. or you can uh, him. Actually, can no. Yeah. So the thing is. <laughs> Wait, is that a, like? Can I actually do that? I thought that I needed to actually have an improvised skill thing or whatever. No, I just mean both of you attacking him together. Yeah. Or, oh, uh, yeah. Both of you targeting him with your individual yeah. attacks. Yeah, I mean, my intention was to basically just like uh, to, to attack him and, and and see if at yeah. some point I can intimidate him into telling uh, him the other. Because Twinkie's on your shoulder, so like if you move to attack someone else, Twinkie's gonna have it harder to attack. Uh, that's well, I have to, the thing is, I have I have Antonio next to me, and I have the dude who tried to stab me next to me. So I have yeah. I have. I almost feel like it's better to thin out the crowd. Uh, yeah. Remember, the guy who tried to stab you got a pretty heavy blow to him from uh, Salem's magic missile. Yeah. Um, is it possible for me to like, like when I when I when I two hand the quarter staff, is that just simply a one like I'm targeting one person thing, or is it a can yeah, I... You are. You can only target one person. Okay, so I'm doing vertical strikes instead of horizontal strikes. I got an idea. If you if you attack someone else first, I got an idea. Okay. Uh, so basically, I'm. I so think. You. I guess well, the thing answer that's... to this is because I'm going to take the help action in order to ensure that your next action rolls with advantage. Ah. Uh, but I need to know what your target is first. Yeah. Yeah. Um, well, if I, if there's no, no, like, you know, hitting multiple people in the short range kind of thing. There um, is not, not yeah. with your abilities. Okay, okay. I what about to... my abilities? Not yet, anyway. <laughs> well, I, I would imagine Twinkie's, like, he's focused on one target right now. Yeah. So. I'm mad yeah. at, I'm mad, I'm mad at all. Regard, who, who are you? I'm mad at all. Kirby, who are you hitting? Um, so Please I, make a decision. okay. decision. So I guess, like, I was going to try to strike, uh, Antonio. But there's the dude literally, another second dude literally right next to me. So I'm just going to try to, uh, I would I would use the quarter staff on him. To an, okay. To so handy. here's what the form this takes. Like uh -huh. the moment this guy uh, takes a swipe at me, I take a couple of steps away and I turn around towards the dude Kirby is about to attack, and I say, "Now hold on a second, everybody. We we can we can talk our way through this, and everybody can just you know." And I start like I start bloviating about peace and love and everything else, and I'm pretty sure that Kirby goes right after me while I give him the help action. Uh, correct. And you're talking. Uh... People are kind of thrown off for a moment, uh, just a couple of seconds, which does give Kirby an opening to attack. Or, sorry, Jinnipro an opening to attack. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I guess it's my turn then? I'm yes. not a pacifist. Okay. Don't pacifist through anyone, I just don't think this is <laughs> worth doing. Alright, so I guess I, just standing where I am, just I pull out the quarterstaff, uh, just the quarterstaff, two-handed, and just swing at the guy who's just who had just gotten hit by magic missile and also tried to stab me. So... Alright, make your attack roll. Uh, so it's two hand, and I have to click on it. Yep. I think all we need to do is just speak softly. Uh, you managed to hit him. Roll damage. Um, just uh, click on the name of the hand. thing in the chat. Oh, I thought I just did that. 
Apparently not. Cl in the chat, in the chat, not in your character sheet. Oh, oh, in the chat, so I click... Oh, oh. wow, okay. You yeah. bring that down, you smack him upside the head, you see his, like, blood is coming out, and he... His face hits the f hits the ground. Uh, uh, he's oh. not dead, but he's out for the count. Now you see, we all just need to speak softly, and I clap. Uh, I clap Jennifer on the back and carry a big stick. <laughs> also, uh, also carry a rabid, rabid person on my shoulder. Twinkie, it is now your turn. <laughs> uh oh. Okay. Oh boy. So who who are we next to right now? Everyone's uh, you are okay. directly next to uh a man knocked out on the ground and Antonio, but. Antonio is. If you attack Antonio, you're gonna suffer from disadvantage because of uh, what Kirby just did. Oof. There you go. And oh, also, I would like you to roll athletics to stay uh, <laughs> with you, to make sure that you stay on Kirby while you're attacking. <laughs> oh, okay. oh yeah, yeah. you stay on Kirby. You stay on Jinnipro's shoulders just fine while you take your swing at, uh... His legs are tightened At so Antonio. <laughs> He's not moving anywhere. <laughs> so, I'm gonna be at disadvantage. Uh, yeah, you're... It basically just make your attack roll normally, and it'll be the lower of the two numbers instead of the one on the left. Alright, so... You take out your spear, you thrust at him, but he easily parries it with his rapier, dodging to the side. And... Now, it is Antonio's turn, and he takes a stab up at you. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Let me roll up and make sure... Yeah, plus six. Oh god, plus six. <gasps> yeah, alright, and uh, Twinkie's armor class is 13, so this hits. Oof. Uh, he Wait, does... is it 13 plus arm an armor defense? No, it's it's 13. His, okay. his armor class is just 13. Yeah, he's uh, got right. right now, and he's got the he's got the decks and such and the ka, the con. Uh, you take eight damage, what? Twinkie. What? Oh. oh, Twinkie, are it's you in a rage right now? Uh, he is not because he did. Uh, we'll say Nova took the rage action, so uh, have the damage. Yeah, because so I think you know, he was already rage raging. Is before. Rage is a yeah. is a free action, yeah. Yeah. Uh, so you or only take four damage. Bonus action. So I'm looking out for you there, Twinkie. <laughs> uh, I am the rules layer. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. I'm the rules layer now. I'm the captain now. Uh, so Antonio takes his rapier. I just realized the music stopped. Uh, we need uh, some nice, awesome music. Uh... It's been stopped. Uh, okay, I guess. What? Okay. <laughs> I would expect it. Like... I don't know. I just kind of clicked on one of the random tracks I added, and this is what it was. Yeah, I would expect it some Gruus's theme, but okay. Hang I was on. expecting Final Fantasy from the Legend of I probably have something better. <laughs> oh. Wilson was starting to enjoy it. <laughs> Alright. Okay. okay. Alright. Uh, I will have to look for more battle music later, but this works. <laughs> okay, so. Uh. So, Antonio's rapier goes out and he stabs. He manages to strike piercing Twinkie's skin, but the muscles are hardened and it manages to keep out the blow and prevents it from doing too serious damage. Antonio pulls his rapier back and he takes uh, he takes a step back. Uh, oh my god, this man's muscles! <laughs> now listen here. You are what you worthy to me, gnome. What you just did to Twinkie. Twinkie didn't feel any of that, but when Twinkie gets over to you, he's gonna rip both your arms off and start pounding you with them. I'm gonna I'm gonna use intimidation on that too. Uh, all right, give me an intimidate check with advantage. Wow. Okay. He's sweating, <laughs> and, he, and he takes uh he takes a few more steps back. He's about 15, 20 feet away from Jennifer, 
and Twinkie. She moved that far back. <laughs> yeah, he's scared. <laughs> he's dodge rolling backwards like Dark Souls. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> Correct. So uh, if I, Elephant, if... It, is, it is your turn. All right. Uh, looking behind me, I see Tim and Rookie are keeping the other two busy behind us. <laughs> Speak for I'm yourself. Gonna... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and uh, take another shot at... Uh, what's his name? The Antonio. Antonio. Uh, Antonio, yes. Go ahead and... Uh... Oh my oh, god! Oh lord! Yeah, okay, roll surprise. damage! Yeah, the double damage. Uh. Ooh! Your he has, arrow! He has Hunter's Mark too, so. Oh, roll another d6. <laughs> oh man, that is 15 damage. Um. Your arrow. Oh. Rip. You knock at your arrow. Pull it back. You aim. And now that Antonio is away from your friends, you have a clear shot. And you let loose. And it impales him. It goes right into his chest. Stab my friends, you son of a bitch. He's sta- He's- He falls to the ground. Barely holding himself up, but he is still conscious. Oh, dear. Am, am I able to like you know speak to the to the, the the you know the rest of the dudes around? Uh, you can speak. Yes. Okay. Do you guys really want to keep fighting us at this point? Um, as they look around, um, uh, the bandits just uh give me a persuasion check, Curb, with advantage. Okay. Uh, persuasion was. Hmm. Oh. The bandits kind of look between each other, and they look at their wounded boss, and they they drop their weapons and take a step back. You're welcome. Now, what was that about uh, giving us all of your valuables? <laughs> I, think, a, uh, let's... I think I like your shoes <laughs> there, buddy. After Antonio's all, Antonio's just kind of coughing up blood right yeah, now. Yeah, I was gonna say, after all, how else are we going to be able to afford treatment for your boss? <laughs> okay, so, so is Timothy just gonna, is like so? If I try to even uh, a walk towards that guy, is Timothy just gonna like just stop me? Oh, I'm going to give him a reassuring pat on the ass. I just want to see what we can extort out of these people first. Um, <laughs> the bandits are like... The crown. Uh, they look between each other and they're like... We... We don't have anything on us. Well we, then, I guess you're just going after the cars for the time camp. being. What did you say, Gray? I guess you're just going to have to be ours for the time being. Yours? Oh yes. Followers, friends. We did say they that we needed some help around friends. here. Whips around like a, friends, like a dog who right heard a them. squirrel. Friends? Um, I'm just rubbing but... my head like a migraine. Do we really just want these people as friends? They just tried to kill us. After Winky. all, I just kind of walk up to uh, to Arsenio Hall over here, and I use one of my spell slots to give him a healing uh, to give him a healing touch. All right. I take it you uh, remove the arrow as well while you're at it. Oh, you I just yank it right out of him and just kind of. <laughs> he like the Not pain of it brain. almost causes him to fall unconscious, but then uh, oh, he's then I brought just put my hand gently on yeah, I just put my hand yeah. gently on his chest and give just him a don't cure, don't uh, give a him a full wound. just just a slight heal, not a full, no, just just oh just, no, 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 no 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 no, he's gonna get one d eight plus my spellcaster bonus hit points back, and then he's going to thank us for saving his life, and then he's going to serve us or run away. <laughs> Or run away, that's also a possibility. And Let's see what happens now. Don't, won't but remember, we have tweaking. Uh, can I get my arrow back, too? <laughs> I just uh, kind of toss it back to him. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, Thanks. It's bloodied, and it's uh, You're gonna not... You're going to want to clean that. It might be infected. <laughs> uh, it's just going to be you, a charm. You would now. have to repair that arrow. Oh, uh, no. I'm just breaking the tip off and using it. There we it. go. No, 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 no. I also say uh, 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 we're going to need to hear... At least some uh, kind of oh, apology yeah. from Twinkie is still in a blind 
blinding rage. Uh, Twinkie, how are you responding to all these bandits surrendering after calling you short? I'll punch a tree. Give me I want to offer Twinkie all a, compel. a piece of your ear. <laughs> uh, listen, no, Twinkie, Twinkie, listen, listen. Uh, I think maybe we can go for an apology. We Listen, we need to go through this forest okay. as safely as possible. If they are missing an ear, it might give them some some problems. Jinapro, give me persuasion with disadvantage. Oh, uh, Twinkie, give me a charisma saving throw with advantage. It's a tie. Uh... Alright, uh, Twinkie, I will let you decide whether or not you listen to him or not. <sighs> Can I step Fine. in for Fine. a second? Fine. Okay. Twinkie, Twinkie will understand that Twinkie still wants part of their ears inside yeah, deeply. Uh, what, Il Ilthin, something, something, something up? Mm -hmm. well, um, just, why not take a finger? No, uh, no, 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 Listen, we need I do it all these, the time for we, goblins. We need these guys to be able to, you know, stay with us and guide us through this place. Can we As you guys them? are talking, another figure emerges from the woods. This one is in dark camouflaged robes uh, with a hood and a mask covering his face. Is anyone able to try to detect that person, or...? What do we need to cast him? Yeah, I see. Uh, you don't have to detect it. You, He's not trying to hide himself anymore. Oh, okay, anymore. okay. Uh, he's emerged from the woods. Yeah, I'm just gonna give, uh, give Arsenio Hall over here <laughs> a, uh... Uh, yeah. yeah. Um, just help him to his feet, just kind of dust him off a little bit. He says, now, don't you feel better? Y yes I, I do feel quite better. Uh, <laughs> he coughs up a little bit more blood. Now that should be the last of that, though. Who's your friend? Uh, uh, when he sees the cloaked figure, his eyes just kind of go wide into a panic. And he's, he starts just going like... Oh, oh. He's not making any sense. Uh... <laughs> Uh, sir, uh, hey, does any of you know what what's this this guy? All about? of the bandits are having similar reactions, and they're kind uh, of back. They're backing away and like falling over and just trying to get away from. Hey, hey, hey! He's hold like, on, hold on, you guys. Jenna, bro, walk over to one um, of the bandits right now. Uh, As one of them are trying to run, the hooded figure takes up his bow, ooh. fires an arrow, and it lands. Like Ilthin scratching is... the ears of one of the bandits, and they all just freeze. Ilthin is interested. Oh. oh. Oh, I should probably help this one dude who is also on the ground. <laughs> just... <laughs> Timothy doesn't really care. He just simply just like. <laughs> oh right, there was one guy that's just completely. Yeah, out. I'm gonna. I mean, I'm gonna. I'm gonna like start dressing his wounds and stuff like that. Just yeah. unconscious. Yeah, he's he's no he's way. been cracked upside the head. I gotta I gotta tie him up a little bit. Make sure he's all right. Um. Yeah. I'll get to you, I'll get to you, Twinkie. <laughs> uh, you know, it would be nice if you heal him soon, because, you know, he's kind of bleeding over my oh, armor. Oh, he's dying. You hit him really hard. What? I... Oh, okay, okay, one thing that's not... Not you, you. I... <sighs> Twinkie approves, Jennifer. Uh, listen, what, what's... Okay, sir, sir, with the, you know, the, the hood and the, the bow... You um, take care do... of him, I'll take care of him. Can can we help you? Do 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 you need? He shakes his head and he just kind of looks at the bandits. He's not speaking. Um, can you not? Um, I guess, uh, spook them anymore. Um, we we. He we, shakes his head again. We <laughs> kind of need to like get out of this forest. You know, we're 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 trying to you know. He points back the direction you came from. Hmm. Can I approach this man? Not too close. Just uh, about to the same distance as Jennifer and try to converse with him. Sure. Hello. I see you are a fellow man of the woods. Do you mind me telling me what you're doing out here with them? Are you a part of their group? He shakes his head. Hmm. I see. 
We're not getting anything out of him, guys. Let's go. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Twinkie wants to know, do you have beef with them, too? He nods his head. <laughs> guys, I think we, I think we yeah. should let let him do his business. Uh, I, I think he's also a fellow <laughs> ranger, and we need to leave. We don't want uh, to piss him off. He, uh... Hangs his bow over his shoulder and uh, pulls out a sword. Hey, listen, we 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 made like a little 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 temporary deal, like you know. Well, I mean, they haven't exactly agreed, but we're, we're uh, still. He kinda... starts walking forwards and he uh, attempts to shove you out of the way. Give me a strength uh, saving throw. <laughs> oh God! Stop trying to reason with him. I I think we need to leave, please. I do not. Uh, want to fight this he man. successfully shoves you out of the way uh, and. Okay. Uh, keeps walking towards the bandits. Twinkie um, suggests we all leave. Right? Listen, Arsenio, I think you need to come with us. Come on. <laughs> Let's bring the Salem boss. right now uh, is just kind of staring in between Antonio and the and the strange man. And Antonio... The man, uh, brings out his sword and he he's going towards Antonio specifically. Yeah, we're, we're oh, gonna okay. take so... Antonio with us and start fucking running. Uh, I think okay. Might wanna... Wait, yeah. Wait. Honestly, I don't want this guy tracking us. I, I don't no! want this guy dying. Not after I just Salem, wasted one of my daily what, spells. What, yeah, uh, bro, what you suggest leaving Antonio behind, she just, Salem just kind of runs over and kind of grabs onto him and starts uh, frowning. Well, Her yeah, face no, is really I'm, I'm red right now. We're taking him with us. This guy is not uh, good. The man him. in the robe pauses for a moment when he sees Salem grab onto him. But then he can, uh, but he, he lifts up his sword. Is anybody going to attempt uh, to stop I'm, this? I'm starting to charge towards. Wait! Like... Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Yeah, please. Twinkie only has one request. Can I take a piece of this here before you do your business? <laughs> oh my god! No! Uh, the road. Or... The man stops and he looks towards you and. Uh, Antonio starts begging for his life. <laughs> please! <laughs> Do not let him kill me! He's been after me for weeks, weeks, I'm, months, I don't know, I'm years, maybe? Sure well, we... first of all, what did you do to him? I just, um, uh, 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 he doesn't answer, though. What? Okay. Uh, the man in the hood is... So, how, okay, uh, so I start, I try to start charging, I mean, not, not charging, like, as in, like, going to attack oh. him, I just start running in attempt to get, I guess, in between. Uh, uh, in between two... When he sees you running, uh, I was going to attempt to run in between them? Whoa, really? Uh, sure I'm going to that? attempt... Shield up, right? Yeah, 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 with the shield up, yeah, yeah. That's I was uh, trying to get to that, too. With all the right, shield up, uh, trying to get, you know, just stand in between, not do uh, anything so specific. I'm going... I'm going to... Basically, I'm rolling this at, uh, an attack with disadvantage. I have the modifiers in my head. Yeah, oh, okay. uh, he swings his sword, not caring about you, but your shield stops it cleanly. <gasps> Can I offer okay. this man some vodka to some time just to sit down and talk? <laughs> now, uh, no, no, no. I, now, he is not up. interested in your vodka. Okay, I, I'm no. also, I'm, as I am, you know, I'm deflecting this thing, I, I try to speak to Antonio saying, Sir, what is it that you did to this guy? Oh, I, I'm I'm basically uh, taking Antonio and absconding while Kirby is distract. I mean, while Jinfro is distracting him. Uh, I'm following with uh, Antonio. <laughs> yes, so be brave. Your Jinnipro. party begins to abandon you, Jinnipro. Uh, I, I'm not still here, party, but two people begin to abandon you, Jinnipro. And uh, the ra the the hooded man would like to attempt to to uh slip past you. I. Uh, would you like to stop him, or would you like to let him go? Wait, uh, I, I have I have a plan. This might sound really dumb, but is it possible for us to like throw this man, and then for me to cast feather fall, and for him to just start be stuck in the air, falling really slowly, <laughs> and then we could leave? No, because first of all, he's gonna take out his bow and shoot him. Oh, okay. Never mind. Dumb idea. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Although that is a really creative use of feather fall, I gotta say. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. I liked it. Uh, I would, I would approve of that. Uh, I would let you do that, uh, if you still wish to. <laughs> he would just—he'd just be kind of an open. Someone target. would need to throw him first. You want Twinkie to throw him up in the air? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Let's, 
I mean, we could. I feel like we're better off trying to dodge his bow shots. Okay. Right? So, okay. so, Jinnipro, I... this uh, the hooded man's attempting to slip past you. Still, would you? Um, I would, would you like to attempt to stop him? I would. Uh, no, I would not attempt to stop him. I would simply just try to focus on trying to keep up with the others. Uh, he's realizing... going a, hmm? a lot faster than you. Okay, 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 throw him, throw him. <laughs> Rookie. Okay, throw him! Rookie. I, I'm, I'm, I'm with Kirby right now. You're talking about Twinkie. You're talking oh, about Twinkie, sorry. Yeah, you're uh, talking oh, Twinkie. oh, Twinkie? Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Wait, wait, you want me to throw... Okay, yes, fine, I'll throw it. him up in the air. Fine, fine! Okay, what do I roll? Oh, I think, uh, headset's, headset's unplugged. unplugged. Oh. Rip. We oh, lost him. I have no idea where I'm at in this. By uh, the way. You were Everybody's running away and I'm still kind of probably just standing in the back. You're in the, you're, I would say you're in like the middle in between uh, me, uh I, I think you're with me because Kirby okay. just ditched us and went to Fruity and Okay! Okay, I'm back. I think. Yes, I'm yep, back. We hear you. Uh my headset came unplugged when Fruity started saying to throw him again. Yeah. So what is it? What is it? That, what is it? Twinkie's uh, rolling. Uh, Twinkie's going to be the one throwing him. Yeah. Uh, athletics. <laughs> Alrighty, this. don't fail me now. Oh. Oh. <laughs> is anybody helping Twinkie throw him? Sure, why not? Kirby, yes. Yeah, yes, I'm Kirby. on Kirby's what? shoulder. So wait. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> How does this work? <laughs> okay. Um, How does this work? <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> wait, okay, wait, so wait, here's wait, wait, what happens. Jinnapro throws Twinkie. So Jinnapro, give me an athletics check. <laughs> so that this can work. Okay, okay. You said athletic? Yes. Okay. Well, no, I wanted to throw the band in the mask. No, 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 guy. this is. Oh! <laughs> okay, so oh here's God. what happens. Jinnapro takes Twinkie and throws him full force, and he starts rocketing towards Antonio. And then Twinkie. With the added force from the throw from Jinnipro, grabs Antonio and spins <laughs> in midair, throwing him, oh, no, launching no, I him. No, I meant the other guy. You other guy. Oh wait, what? Basket. We're not throwing Antonio. Oh, we're, we're throwing we're the, the hooded mask. Yeah. What? Yes. Oh, we're throwing the. We're <laughs> throwing the hooded mask. <laughs> It's too late. It's too okay, late. so we're throwing. Who are we throwing? We're throwing the hooded man. We're throwing, we're throwing the, the man. Okay. <laughs> we're, wait, who are we throwing? We're throwing the, the hooded, hooded man. Nova. We're throwing who him in the air throwing? so that we can cast feather. No, no, and our... make him suspend. I thought we were casting that on <laughs> in other days. No. Okay, <laughs> Nova, oh Nova, God. who is Twinkie throwing? This is your decision. I mean, it oh. works either way, so... Yeah, it really does work either way. It's just a matter of, like, what are we gonna, like, what are we gonna do about it? <sighs> <laughs> the choice lies on your shoulders. Throw the masked man in the air. <laughs> you throw the masked man into the air, and he goes launching like Team Rocket. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and as he disappears... I cast well, well, like before he like goes. While he's fall, flying, cast you cast Featherfall. Featherfall. And, okay. Uh, he's so gone, yeah, he's, but he's stuck in the air for quite a while. He's just gone, <laughs> out of sight, out of mind. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it works. <laughs> is this so? Uh, okay, this is gonna be a problem we're gonna be dealing with later, I'm sure. But why didn't we just do that to one of the bandits? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. The band, uh, the bandits that are conscious, start kneeling and praising their very existences <laughs> for saving them from this masked man. Yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm dressing the one that that Kirby cracked out so uh, <laughs> as well. Just out of, out of nowhere, just Twinkie's just speaking in muscle. He's just flexing in the corner, just mmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh god. Boy. Uh, How does this even work? <laughs> Why? Hey man. The real magic power of wizards is being great. <laughs> <laughs> I assume I'm just standing there watching all of this doing nothing. 
I, I, assume he's also, <laughs> I assume he's just taking another swig from you know from his flask. Wait, I'm just so standing there, just okay. What was Antonio's reaction to the whole thing? Throughout, Antonio was like, Ricky's with me. <laughs> yeah, I'm just with you. Kneeling like, before you guys, uh, praising your very existences. Um, <laughs> he is not praising Ven, however. Oh shit, Ven's oh. deafened. So, uh, hmm. <laughs> oh. We'll have to tell Ven that later. <laughs> uh. What would you guys like to do now that you have uh, a group of five bandits? Uh, if I'd like to invite Antonio, uh, Antonio along with us. Seems um, like a cool dude. He, oh, you were he, so wrong. He, I. Uh, how specific? Uh, specifically, would you uh, like to invite him? Oh, I'm, what, I'm, I'm saying that his entire crew should be rolling with us. Yeah, you know, but like, at... uh, what are your words? Well, um, well, I, I'd like to say I'd so, like to say before, <laughs> uh, uh, before I guess uh, Timothy does the official invitation, I say like, <laughs> I, well, I guess you guys just saw what we did. We, I would really appreciate it if you guys would, you know, help guide us through here. Yeah, I think you've all learned a very valuable lesson about crossing us. No, hold up one second. You still haven't answered our question. Who's the masked man, and why is he trying to kill? Us? <laughs> uh, oh, uh, the, the. Don't worry about him. He won't. I don't think you he'll... better tell me now, or you'll go flying just like that guy. <laughs> uh, give me an Boy. intimidation check. I'm just gonna sit down on a log. <laughs> Wouldn't it be a intimidation with advantage? Oh! <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> He's the guardian of this forest, and we kind of using it as a bandit hideout without his permission, and he really doesn't like us. Well, the obvious answer here is for you to come with us and find yourselves a new hideout. <laughs> Very well. We'll, we'll yeah, no, no, don't worry about it, man. We're gonna no, we're gonna help you. We're what? gonna set you guys up with wonderful new. Jo There's a new queen in this kingdom. You see, the, oh! this King Aldebrand has a new queen. Oh, oh that's where we are. I was wondering. Uh, if, uh, how many of you are proficient in history, or have been uh, uh traveling have, around a lot? I'm perfectly fine with it. I, I can make. The I got. Salem yeah, has read many history uh, books about. Uh, uh, Depends on the definition of how good history is. No, I'm, proficiency. I'm pro oh, proficiency. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, 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 that's not me. That's yeah, I've got proficiency. Yeah, I've got yeah. proficiency okay. as well. Uh, if you have proficiency in the skill... Uh, I'm a bard, I'm fine. Yeah, uh, go ahead and uh, make a history check, those of you that are proficient. Well, I just did. That's a 19, actually, not an 18. Okay. Uh, yeah, all of you know about Aldebrand. Uh... It is signif a significant distance from, uh, I will, uh, just Illness? give you the, uh, the handout, uh, edits in player's journals, uh, all of you passed, so, uh, well, I guess Salem, Rookie, and Timothy, yeah. so, gray, and... Yeah, that's some jack of all trades shit right there. I have half yeah. my proficiency bonus added to basically everything. Oh right. I love how, yeah. we, I love how the mob fares is five, four, and three. <laughs> so yeah, go ahead and uh Huh. That's Choose to very that. <laughs> That's very far from home. Yeah. Oh my. Uh Boy. go ahead we and are uh, very far just... from everywhere before. Uh, well, I don't know um, how far that is from home, though. You can go ahead and share whatever information you feel like from that. Yeah, uh, I'm just document. gonna let, say, well, uh, actually, I'm kind of curious uh, if there's anything I can discover or anything I can estimate from how far we were thrown from the spell um, for us. If you were to go, so uh, Yilmaz and Aldebrand have a training relationship. It's about a three-month voyage. <laughs> hmm. uh, so. <sighs> but I mean, like, could I suss out how powerful the spell that that tossed us here was? Um, you could <sighs> give me an Arcana I... check. Sure. Okay. How about I? I try that too. Uh, both of you can uh, make an Arcana check. That feels we'll like a thing can... Salem would do. We'll see if Oof. we can work it out. Oof. Anyway, that's a twenty-four. Uh... <laughs> Nat twenty. I'd like to point out that I probably know exactly how powerful the queen is as well from my past experience. I share none of this. Uh, all right. Oof. So. Uh, I will whisper to Gray. 
whisper sweet nothings in his ear. <laughs> the kitty's at it again. Uh, there must have been a magic portal in the in the throne room. That explains everything. Some very powerful magic in that old kingdom of Ilmas. I'm very glad that there's a new queen governing it. Well, one as strong and as beautiful as hers. She was quite pretty. Mm-hmm. And very strong. She ripped yes, that man to shreds scary. with a spell very similar to the one that I saw you cast. I'm impressed. Oh, really? Thank you. <laughs> Redacted. <I see>. <laughs> Redacted. <laughs> oh, God. Um. Oh, I guess that means Ben is back, too. Yes. Ven has returned. Uh, Ven, yeah. these bandits are uh, praising the party, but not praising you. Uh, what would you like to say to these bandits? <laughs> well, they're not wrong. <laughs> All right. But I have to say smite them anyway. <laughs> <laughs> just, just I, give them a light slap on the ass. I, I, I turn I turn to the other bandits and I I, I just simply just like uh, I shrug and just I tell them like listen, uh, you know the you know, the diet don't don't mind that voice. Um, you know, she she she's she gets a little 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 uh I get snippy at this time of day. Or maybe uh, all time of day, just, but. they're very concerned now as they look between each other. I don't think they can actually hear her, can they? They can. Yeah, no, 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 no it's, it's already been confirmed they that can. everyone else is hearing Anything Ben whatever. Anything Ben says is heard by all present. Ah, good. Including NPCs. <laughs> He's got his own personal god. It's great. I, I just simply just shrug. Or actually, I guess his god's got his own personal Jennifer. It's great. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, listen, it's, it's fine. Like, you know, she, she says some things from time to time. I, you know... My parents had to deal with her, and, you know, we don't really... I mean, I don't know what the how they really felt, but I... You know, just don't don't, don't worry about her much. Uh, she, she has some good, good, nice things to say from time to time, you know? Uh, Alright, we, we'll take your word for it. Yeah. In any case, I feel like we should get going, though. Yeah. Oh, praise Ben. Wait, he'll twink it! Praise be to Ben. That uh, dress makes you look fat. <laughs> <laughs> Praise Ben. Uh, Praise be to Ben. Uh, Mr. Um, <clears throat> Mr. Uh, uh, Hatfield. No, no. Hat well, yes, but Hatfield. Yes, Hatfield. Uh, yes. Hatfield. Can you um, can you assist um, with uh, you know Mr. Twinkie's uh, little bleeding issue? Twinkie has a boo boo. Oh, I mean, it's not a very serious boo boo. Yeah, I was going to say I'm I. I, I'm basically going to be like, let me tell you about the time when I was stabbed in a back alleyway by, I, I just, I just go into a long story about how, uh, how terrible it was being stabbed, but how with a stiff upper lip and a, and determination, I managed to make my way through and pull my, pull, and claw my way to the man that I am today. So this Twinkie will be is hard enough for your bullshit. He'll Twinkie right now. <laughs> yeah, well, that, that is. <laughs> That's my song of rest. You get an, uh, you can you can heal uh, an an extra one d six during a short rest. Uh, okay. Would you guys uh, like to take a short rest? Yeah, you can just use one of your hit dice to do it. Uh, yeah. The bandits will uh, lead you to a nearby spot that's decently safe to rest. It's a uh, clearing off the uh, off the road, not too far from here. It's where they were waiting to ambush you. So yeah, we're just gonna take a short rest and get on our way. Yep. Mm -hmm. yep. Uh, it'll be about an hour. Well, we're gonna we're gonna find yeah we're gonna find these guys uh, a new place to live. Yes. Yeah, you know Wait. What? I, I like this I like this side quest that we just we just formed ourselves here. <laughs> this is find not Mandic how I was expecting to this to go at all. <laughs> yeah. Well. <laughs> Wait, 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 so during this hour, can I rest and also use the Tinkerer skill? Uh, let me check. Yeah, you can use one of your hit dice, and I just, I make everybody's hit dice better, and it means that I don't have to worry about spending my spell slots, so. I, uh, so I'm guessing yeah, Tinky is basically fully healed at this point. Do, 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 I didn't even get touched, so. Wait, so does Twinkie have yes, to roll you, for his heal? Um, okay, uh, so no, you can spend a Twinkie. hit dice. 
Uh -huh. uh, if you use Tinker, you will not get gain the benefits of a short rest. Okay, I'll wait. So, yeah. you so but you can use it during a long rest and still get the benefits of said long rest. Okay, I'll wait for a long rest then. Wait, what is the benefits of the short rest? Uh, basically, you just uh, any abilities that rec you recover abilities that recover on a short rest, and you can uh, spend hit dice to heal. So you're gonna get Hunter's Mark back then? Uh, I don't know if that's a... Uh, uh, you'll recover your hit dice again af at uh, after the next long rest. rest. Yes. Okay, so to roll this, I go to my character sheet and... It... Uh, just, uh... You don't have to open your character sheet, just type uh, slash R, 1D, whatever your class hit die is. Which uh, I think for a Barbarian should be 12? Correct. And then you'll get an extra plus one d six for me. Yeah, you don't even fucking need it. Oh, there it is. And then happened. subtract subtract one of your hit dice as well. No, it, it happened again. Roll forty six. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, I'll roll it for you. He roll mites as well. I do not know. You need uh, a what rookie was that? Can you roll mites as well? I'm lost. So that's four. So, Twinkie, you get uh, your points back. Rookie, roll a d8 yeah. and a d6. 1d8 plus 1d6. Wait, Rookie. so can we gain, we gain spell slots at a... No, no you do no, not get your spell rest. slots okay. back unless you're... Uh, I believe unless... I believe warlocks can get their uh, spell slots back from a short rest, though. So, so Hunter's Mark's gotta wait until we take a long rest. Yep. Yep. Okay. Yeah. But that's okay. So yeah, I regale Twinkie with the tale of how I recovered from my back alley stab wound, <laughs> and um, he presumably he starts feeling right as rain. Twinkie uh, senses some bullshit in this story. Uh, <laughs> it's not bullshit, it's the power of positive thinking. Take a look Wait, at your stomach. Archer. So why did I have to roll these? You didn't have to. It's just I to recover hit points. It's something oh. you can do if you want to recover hit points, but it is not mandatory. So I'm all good. Yeah. 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 We're, we're... It's, just, it's just Twinkie that was the only one that needed to do that. Yep. He was the only one who took a hit during the fight, and uh, yeah, I also uh... took a hit. Oh. Oh yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah. Yeah, you get it back. Yeah. That's so damage. I should be good. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> okay. Um. So, I'm telling you, my friend, it's the power of positive thinking. Look at your stomach. No sucking chest wound now. So, I love how everyone forgets about me. <laughs> well, I mean, like... What magic is this? <laughs> um, can, can I possibly, like, uh, I guess, like, uh, speak to them or ask them questions or anything like that? Uh, yeah, you can ask them questions during the short rest. Okay. Uh, so, what, uh, how far is it from, uh, I guess, any kind of civilization? Well, I suppose there's, a. Uh... There's a small village, uh, half a day's travel still through the, uh, through the forest. Half a day. That's what the, uh, the hooded man was protecting. Okay, so it might... Uh, don't mm. worry, don't worry, we don't attack the village. We, we always left that one well alone. We, mm. uh, we're not that, that's, uh, morally reprehensible. Mm. Is there... Is there anything going in in on the village or around the village? Uh, what do you mean? Just happening? Rumors. Rumors? Uh, not, we don't really go to the village. So I'm afraid I can't tell you. Okay. Is, this well, might seem you... like a weird question, but have you seen any brass dragons flying overhead? I've never seen a dragon in my life. Oh, okay. And she looks to kind of... A little, a little dejection. Uh, he Don't quickly worry. switches over to uh, flirt mode and takes Salem's hand. But I'm sure if I saw one, it would not even compare to the beauty of seeing you. I'm gonna shut that shit down real quick. <laughs> <laughs> like, her face, she just freezes and her face just goes red and it's like that, like the like yeah, like that uh, face. Not having any of that. Uh, like sir, that. Sir, can I still have questions? Hello? Oh, oh, so, oh sorry, I was, uh... He gives a s sideways glance at Salem. Distracted. 
I just simply, I, I, I'm just like holding my, my, my arms around my, uh, you know, folding my arms around my chest, and I'm just like, I'm trying to ask questions here. Are you jealous? I'm trying to ask questions here. Well, then ask your questions. Thank you. So, is there any other, I guess, village around here? Uh, just any, any other villages beyond, beyond? Uh... No, the nearest, uh, the nearest other, uh, I bumped the dial. The nearest other civilization is a, a city of Aldebrand, uh, not the capital, uh, the name is, oh, Ravalino. Uh, it's about, uh, 12 days travel away from here. Uh, how, how Did we are just you just get teleported to Spain? <laughs> Basically, well, <laughs> Spain slash Italy. Okay. Twelve days. That'll take a while. You know, Twinkie has an idea. What if we throw one of you over there to that village? You can make a shorter trip. Uh, and Salem over here can cast her feather, whatever that stuff was, to send you to send you your way uh, and you know, gently fall to the ground. I don't think. Um, I'm I'm a uh, I'm afraid of heights. Yes, afraid of heights. Uh, Twinkie, says. Mr. Twinkie, um, I, I do. I, I actually listen, listen. I'm gonna be honest with you. I like the idea, but I would feel more comfortable if we would, we would stick together. There, that there's too much uh, separation with that, and you know we're all in. Well, uh, half of this group here is in. Well, I guess we're all sort of in unfamiliar territory here. So it's it'd be a little bit better if we were in a in a little group here. Well, uh, we can show you to the village, or we can show you to our camp. Uh, does, your, does your camp have any cookies? Cookies? Cookies. What? What is? What There's is electable co- treats that cure any disease or plague that you might have. That sounds amazing. We do not have any. No, I've never even heard of them before. Uh, I'm well, a- we did find some at the bar, so maybe we should go to the town. Well, it's that that sort of thing is like not not every every kingdom knows or has those kind of recipes. Um, I mean, I'm, I might be able to give some tips on how to maybe do that if they have the right type of plants around here. But um, listen, listen, hold on, hold on. I, I we I feel like I, I got another question here. Um, actually, what, uh, how 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 exactly have you guys been surviving? Here, you just simply just been just uh, foraging, uh, stealing from less powerful travelers. Uh-huh. I didn't think there'd be many travelers coming. Uh, around this we place. were there aren't, but um, well, uh, every like week or so, a merchant caravan comes through. They usually are like you know, it's run by pretty nice people actually. They uh, they're pretty willing to hand over about half of their uh half of their haul to us for free and by free i mean uh, yeah for yeah yeah their yeah. Lives. yeah yeah you know. uh, yeah uh, what how long has it been since there been the uh, last uh it was a couple of days ago since the uh since the last carriage so it'd be like four five days hmm. until the next one ah uh, well you, but if you uh started walking towards the city you might uh might run into it on the way. I don't think we have enough supplies to make it all the way to the city, though. Yeah, yeah. Well, Wait. you can ask the Let's village. Let's just go to the village. Or right. we yes. can uh, show you to our camp. We have supplies there. Let's go to the village, guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, the thing is, I, I I would like to go to the village, but at the same time, I feel uncomfortable bringing these guys to the village. Twinkie suggests that we rob a carriage. I. <laughs> I would Twinkie, not rob a carriage. Yeah, no, Twinkie, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to say no well, to let's, that. Well, let's put it this way. Do you really want us to go to the camp? Not really, no. What village if... Village it is. I have an idea. What? What if we go to the village, but we'll stay... Some of us will stay outside the village with the bandits while some others go in and kind of test the waters a bit. Okay, I, I kind of like that. That sounds like okay. a good idea. Yeah, yeah. It's a village. There's got to be a tavern, Hiroshi. You don't. Okay, they so. They probably heard of you too. So. <laughs> so, 
So, okay, so, you know, once we're all ready to get get up and going, I I would... I know there's this little a little bit of apprehension towards the village. Um, I know the guy was protecting the place. Um, I don't know where... Okay, okay, actually, no, I'm starting to get, a, get an idea here. So, we, you know, in our intrusion in this land, we kind of, like, maybe upset the balance by removing the protector of the village. Uh, maybe we can, you know assist temporarily or maybe have you guys assist with taking what? taking his place and protecting the village for a bit you'll probably get a lot more consistent money if you try and help people instead of uh, stab them for cash yes I mean, and also there's I, much less of a I risk mean, of you know running into people like us who are much very willing to stab <laughs> you back well um i don't know i i feel like helping people has a tendency to uh get us into just as much trouble as hurting people well, you can make the argument that at least helping people will make you sleep better at night, whereas hurting people I don't know, is normally I, I, I wrong. I sleep pretty well at night. Huh? I, I sleep pretty well at night. Oh, I mean, I'm, I'm not, not, not like... I, I wouldn't call myself evil. I'm just making ends meet in the way I have. How... Is this, char and, this character you know, is true neutral, uh, isn't he? Yeah, I think that you I'm... You know, I think steal that from just... the rich, give to the poor, that kind of thing. And the poor being us. How... I'm just wondering, how long do you think you'll be, uh living this life that you have here well until you guys came along i figured until i died oh he's until proselytizing shoot him again. let me uh, shoot him what again. was that who said something i said "Ooh, jinpro is proselytizing <laughs> <laughs> uh, spread the good word well, we can talk this... about it in the village let's go to the village please <laughs> i think it would be a good idea for you to spread the good word of ven to them uh this I you know I think they'd be a little bit more intimidated by Ven, but you know I think everyone seems like they're they're in good shape now. Uh, let me let's let's, how, let's start. Do that bitch. Imagine what, how they'll feel. What was that, Ven? When they have such a strong yeah. god protecting them. What did Ven say? I think it's just hair protecting. Nice joke. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> So hey, listen, listen. We we all seem to be fine now. I mean, we, we gather our, our breath and whatnot. Let's let's start let's start get up and start moving. Uh, maybe we can just keep talking about this along the way. Like I'm saving their sorry asses from damnation. <laughs> <laughs> praise be to Ben. So yes, praise be to Ben. So yeah, uh, you know, then you know, I guess has had her say. Um, you might not want to, you know die soon maybe you know what what <laughs> <laughs> uh twinkie has made an offering to praise ven oh, uh how do you respond to this offer ven uh oh good job this <laughs> <laughs> could have gotten worse <laughs> Uh, perhaps she's a little little placated right now. I try to materialize a sock. <laughs> a sock? Uh, <laughs> Alright, a sock uh, floats down from the sky and lands on Twinkie's face. <laughs> uh, it, it's a clean sock. Yeah, it doesn't smell of anything. Yeah, Tell bless me be. a <laughs> A blessed garment. Twinkie phrases then. Twinkie was missing a sock this entire time. <laughs> Did this mean Twinkie is free? <laughs> you... Oh my god. I guess this is a miracle. Like Fucking copycats. <laughs> <laughs> no sock. <laughs> what? No. Uh... <laughs> Is, is, is the sock gone now? Uh, the the almighty deity, Dungeon Master, intervenes and keeps the sock in existence. Okay, yeah. okay. we can use the you sock for something later. You never know when it'll, 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 it'll come in handy. Yeah, it shatters. At best, you can put it on your hand and you'll have a new friend. <laughs> Friends? Oh no. yes, observe. I'm gonna, well, if Twinkie will allow me. Uh, okay. Right, I take the that sock and I put it on my hand Twinkie and I invert trying it. to praise me for another sock. Oh, oh, oh. oh okay. Uh, all right. So 
the the game master does not have to intervene <laughs> uh, to keep the sock in existence. So okay. I I begin I take the sock and I put it on my hand and then I invert the mouth in it and then I start speaking like a sock puppet and I say, as you can see, now I am your friend. Salem is entranced. Give me a performance check. <laughs> Oh god, this is the dumbest <laughs> fucking shit. I'm I'm just rubbing my face going, can we please go? No, we no, we're walking. That's we're walking and talking. Okay. By the way. Um, That's actually uh, a twenty-four. Twenty-four? Uh yeah, all of the bandits are entranced by this sock puppet performance <laughs> as well. Yes. Ah, praise be to Ven. So what we're basically doing here is that we are enlightening these these poor folk who don't know any better. <laughs> Twinkie, Twinkie has an idea. Can't we cast some magic on it so it can can become a talking sock puppet that I, shows us where to go? I, that tells us where to go. I, I like your idea. I think I don't know if we're um, anyone's got the strength <laughs> for that sort of ability. Then well, I would certainly you like could to give cause it a try. another miracle. <laughs> no. <laughs> what if I what if I bring you more? What if I Sorry. bring the God Ben? <laughs> It didn't work out. This. Okay. Yeah. I, how about we stick to get all this on the way to town? Yeah, yeah. I, that's what I've been saying. We've been walking and talking. Oh yeah, we're we're, we're I'm I'm helping spread the good word of Ven. <laughs> to uh, uh, what what should we call what should we call my new sock puppet friend? Oh my god. If your current character's name is Timothy. The Lex. sock puppet should be Timothy. <laughs> <laughs> Call him Twataffy. <laughs> Twataffy. Oh God, I this I I don't know if I can. Uh, I'm comfortable with the this 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 name. I mean, like you know, no no no. If anything, this this is this blessing was given upon Twinkie. Mr. Twinkie, I think Mr. Twinkie, Twinkie think should be the one. Should, yeah. Twinkie, you should be the one who name it, names it. Jinnipro is absolutely correct. What shall we call our new friend? <laughs> Progene. Progene. Oh. The sock, the sock puppet is now named Progene. Oh God. I guess I'm gonna have to write that somewhere. Right <laughs> Allies and organization. <laughs> we actually have a sock puppet. Oh. <laughs> what do you think of them apples for that name? I think it's perfectly fine. Oh, oh, no. No. I'm just happy to exist. <laughs> Alrighty, so but we hit the town. The universe is coming someday, after all. <laughs> oh my god. Well, so town. So town. town. Uh, okay. Yeah, so you want to be in the village now? Yeah. Uh, so, well, I, we we need to respond to upon you know approaching the village though. Uh, soon enough. Uh, you can now see the outskirts of the village. Uh, it's sort of built in with the forest that make making it uh very difficult uh to like see when you're just looking from above so it's sort of it's not like secret but it is hidden to a degree so what do we have to cast I mean, me? uh, no you don't have to cast any like it's not hidden so much that you guys can't see it from here it's just hidden from like what Nova had done earlier. Like, you wouldn't be able fucking to... fucking walk okay. into the village hidden in the leaves. It's just a villain. It's it's just a, a hidden village it, it, in the leaves. Yeah. Yeah. So it's... it's yeah, yeah. It, they, my, my there's... Back. Uh, you Does see a sign? single ninja sitting <laughs> on one of the branches <laughs> looking at all of you. And then he disappears before you can say I mean, anything. Okay, I... I immediately just like this... Hearing, or is he jumping from branch to branch with his arms down out behind him? Is there several of those? He is doing that at such a high speed you cannot keep track with your eyes. Uh, Wait, Twinkie has heard about these these kinds of people. They're called samurais. <laughs> ah, the legendary warriors of the Far East. But we're in Spain. 
What? Uh, holy <laughs> <Sargon>. <laughs> no, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, what? <laughs> wait, what? What, what's, what are you confused about, Ricky? Hey, no. Samurai? What? Should I, Fruity, should I be clicking that uh, on the middle of this thing here? Yes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch it. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> oh. Hang on, hang on, hang on, Kirby, you don't oh. have to click on it. Give okay. me a moment. Alright. Um, what is even see. going on right now? Uh, track. Track. I, know, you can tell. Uh, I am so confused. Well, we've discovered a hidden village in the leaves. <laughs> I just see you talking with a sock puppet, a ninja in the tree, and someone saying we're in Spain. <laughs> no, no, that was- that was- ARE YOU SERIOUS?! <laughs> oh. oh, is this Ben? Is this from Ben? This is from Ben. This is from Ben. Oh god. Alright. Uh, just Ben, just, just kill it, just kill it, Ben, please. In the actual Rule 20, so... Oh my yeah. god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so okay, so we we do we all do notice the the ninja, right? Yes. I mean, okay, okay. You all first, notice the ninja, but he's disappears. gone before you can properly re uh, respond to to his presence. Okay. We he just him. said those are samurai. Okay. <laughs> so I I turn to uh. uh Does anyone to the... besides uh Twinkie know what those are? Can, know what can a ninja I is? probably we just, not? We just do oh, sorry. History. What a sure. samurai is. I, just I might know what a samurai is, but only because. I you what? Know. what? <laughs> yeah, oh, no. I guess uh, yeah. they are samurai. Uh, yeah. I guess so, they are samurai. Okay, okay you don't tell you the tales. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm screwed. I'm gonna roll this thing. I'm rolling something. Okay. All right, all of you give me history checks. Oh. <laughs> Sounds legit. Sounds legit. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm just absolutely okay. delighted. Okay. Fruity. Okay. 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 <laughs> so, so Salem and Twinkie, uh, Salem knows about the great exploits of the ninja, while as Twinkie knows about the incredible legendary exploits of the samurai. The rest That's of you know absolutely ninjas. nothing about what you just witnessed. <laughs> Shapoof. They, uh, they, they, they shapoof. Like that. That's how, uh, that's how they roll. I'm not even, I... Well, okay. It's a sound effect. Here, if you you need to feel more secure, then I can have Progene say it. <laughs> okay, uh, so, um, and Mr. <laughs> Mr. Hold on, what was the, the, the bandit leader's name? Antonio? Antonio. No, the last name? El Salvaggio. El Salvaggio, okay. Uh, Mr. Salvaggio, um, do you know anything? I know you said you, you guys never entered this place. Do you know anything at all? With with what just ha what we just saw there? No, I've never seen it in my life. Okay, so I believe they're called ninjas. Nin Twinkie knows the samurais. Uh, okay. Confusion. They're from the far east on the left. Well, so we did agree that we would leave some of the people out of the village so that they could stay with our friends here, and that the rest of us would go in and test the waters. It sounds like Twinkie has a lot of knowledge of this place, and Salem has a lot of knowledge of this place. Yeah, uh, but it like as far as like you know trying to make sure there is, uh, uh, I guess and, like no, and I... hearing that you want um, Salem to go into it. Antonio approaches and says, I, I shall enter with the two of them. I oh, uh, I was I, expecting I you to be coming with us, actually, for continuing you're the yes. leader of this little uh, group. Yes, of yes, I, yes, of, 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 of course, yes. Yeah. That's uh, why, yes. Well, there's no, I that, and uh, I suppose Mr. Wingar over here would probably be a good third member of ours, and then we'll keep watch over the rest of you, now won't we? I'm slightly getting- Illithil is getting slightly jealous of the... Antonio. <laughs> oh, oh, okay! Uh, is he, uh... Is, is he t is he pretty to you, Illithin? Do we need to talk about this? <laughs> well, I mean, considering he has been living in a forest and whatnot... Oh god, you just read that whole situation wrong. <laughs> It's all right. We'll uh, we'll find you someone. For fuck's sake! <laughs> all we're seeking, all we're seeking is a fuck it. We're man. rolling with it, sure. <laughs> <laughs> what? 
Oh, well, saving him with it. He's saving him with his strength, obviously. Oh my god. Oh, god. Um, <laughs> you receive an incredibly motivational pat on the back. <laughs> uh, so motivational, so motivational, in fact, it sends you flying into the village. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, cool. First one in. Okay, as I was about to say, um... Illithin they, they... is already in the village. <sighs> Okay, so as about, I'm just gonna quickly say, uh, considering that one person up there in the trees kind of saw us, there's we can't really hide the fact that uh, that we are on our own if we are going as a separate group. So, uh, do we still want to have this, the the I guess the group uh, split? While you're talking, as Illithin, uh crashes into the village. Uh, a number of the villagers come out of their homes and they just kind of look at him and they're very confused, but they look like normal villagers. Oh god. Uh, any, any, I, mean, any... I think you're getting a little too worried about this, Jennifer. Uh, an old woman walks up and attempts and offers Illithin a hand up. Oh, no. I I am still are you, are you Thank right, you, man. the most dangerous the most dangerous creature in her natural habitat the older the nice older lady <laughs> I I I'm, I'm seeing this from a distance and I'm still looking at as, the others as, in the group uh, yeah, as Elithin crashes in uh, Salem goes after him and then she's like I'm sorry I couldn't cast featherfall in time for that <laughs> he didn't take any damage anyways it was very motivational. <laughs> All right. Well, Hiroshi is going as well. I suppose uh, some of us are going to have to stay behind with the bandits, though. I mean, uh, Antonio takes Salem's hand and starts walking towards the village. I'm... <laughs> okay. Listen, uh, Mister uh, Hatfield, um, are you are you okay with? Are can you handle all of these guys here? Oh yes, absolutely. Okay, uh, let's just take one one more of them, just just so that. Uh, no, no, uh, no, 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 no! Don't worry about it. No, 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 no! It's it's just so that you know, uh, uh, Mr. Uh, Salvaggio does not feel alone. I think I Mr. Salvaggio is going I to have, have no problems with loneliness. Of this wonderful lady. Yes, no, I mean just saying Phil that in the, like in the event that we face. need to leave you behind for whatever reason. I think that Mr. Salvaggio will have no problems with loneliness on this trip. <laughs> So, so, for context, Illithin's getting jealous because Salem is the first female friend that he's had, and he doesn't like Antonio. Yeah, but I'm, I'm, okay. I'm, still, I'm still reading the situation totally wrong. <laughs> Possibly not on purpose. <laughs> Oh god. Okay. So, uh ho okay, 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 okay. Uh, I feel don't like worry I need to, no, uh, don't no, worry about no, no, it. No, I feel like I need to be convinced that we can't bring another bandit person along. All right. So... Well, then yeah, I, uh, I mean, the do bandits you wanna... that are conscious each pull out a deck of playing cards. We'll I also fine. pull out my deck of playing cards. <laughs> 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 Listen, I like I said, I want to at least you know have one other one other bandit friend with Antonio. Anto it's time Antonio to do would be fine. Let's, no, I'm, let's I am insisting heavily. Antonio right. will be fine. He is our boss. He will be Kirby, fine. Kirby, All let's right. just go. Do the plot. Yeah, Alright. So, okay. so who's going in? I'm still confused now. Twinkie, I'm since here. none of I'm you already drinkers here. are going in, Twinkie will walk in. That yeah, no. It's basically everyone uh, everyone except for uh, Antonio, the bandit. Uh, oh, I mean, I'm sorry, no, I'm sorry. Uh, everyone but Timothy, in terms of the, the uh, party here. Timothy, roll me a d20. No modifiers. Uh, Alright. Ooh. Oh, so while the in the game that you are playing, while you oh, I'm wait. not playing with these guys. I've got oh. something planned for the moment that these guys are all out of earshot. Okay, so uh, the rest of the group uh, goes off into the village. Okay. Uh, I so assume I guess that means you will you guys just get... whisper to me your plan. Uh, no, so... I, I'm I'm uh, perfectly fine announcing it. In okay. Okay. All so right. We, so we're all walking, and then we're out of earshot and whatnot. You guys are all free to go. The bandits look between each other, but uh, are you are you sure? Yeah. 
Just, just like that? Oh yeah, don't worry about it. Well, all right. They uh, they pick up their unconscious. Friend. Oh, there is one thing. Oh. Hmm? Uh, gosh, I am a traveler from a very far away land, uh, Il uh, uh, Ilmaz. Are you familiar with it? Never heard of it. Ah, it's across the seas. Just spread the word for us. There's a new queen in town. A, a new queen in Yilmaz. Mm-hmm. Uh, Princess Aelin Yilmaz has been crowned queen. Praise be to her. Queen Aelin Yilmaz. Praise be to her. Uh, sure. Yeah, they all nod, it, nod to each other. Yeah, yeah, we shall, we shall spread the word. If I see any of you again and you forget this message, there will be hell to pay. They gulp individually in sequence, <laughs> and then they nod vigorously. Let's go back to camp, and uh, they take their friend off and uh, vanish into the woods. All right, next I'm gonna make it look like I've been beaten up a little bit. All right, uh, give me. Let me take a look at the skills. It's probably a deception or a discard uh, or whatever. Uh. Give me, uh, deception with, but with, uh, dexterity instead of charisma. So it'll just be one less. Okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> you... <laughs> Dread, I must have grabbed Mother's makeup. <laughs> instead of uh, making yourself look beat up, you make yourself make look, look damn wonderful. beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> you Antonio. Hello, Tim. <laughs> oh, God. So oh, it's, it's the second it's... most handsome man in this kingdom. I assume it's going to be a while before we, uh, we hear uh, from him. Yeah, probably. Okay. Uh, so, we should, we should, what are you guys doing in the village? Hold on, hold on. We should be, should we be taking a break now? Oh, yes. Uh, oh, it's, it's it is hours, break it? time. Uh, so, we will be taking a 20-minute break. Mm. Uh, so, 